What's going on, everyone? Nick Jedi here. So today, I have a small haul for you. Uh, as you know, uh, New Jersey's lockdown has officially ended today. But um, this weekend, Jennifer and I went up to Pennsylvania, met up with Little Cease, and went to some comic shops that were actually open. Uh, I guess their uh, whole lockdown ended way earlier than ours. They still had restrictions, you know, uh, social distancing, making sure you're wearing a mask, yada, yada, yada. Uh, so we went to a couple of shots, picked up some figures. I just want to go through some books that I picked up recently and some books that I picked up over there. There's not many, to be honest with you, but I just wanted to throw something up uh, on the channel today. Uh, so the first book I picked up was the Joker 80th Anniversary. This is the blank with the green and purple splatter. I'm not huge on blank variants, but I think it'll be pretty neat to get something done um, on this. So ho hopefully, once convention time comes back around, uh, we'll be able to do something and get this done. Uh, so the next book that I picked up, it was from this comic shop called Cloud City in PA. It was actually a really neat shop. Um, they did something very interesting. Uh, in their back issue bins, they did not have price, individual prices. What they did was, uh, for example, I picked up this Marvel Age number 98 with the Toxic Avenger on the cover. They have like stickers here. Uh, it's right here. It's like a purple, uh, blue sticker. And uh, uh, wait, purple or blue? Blue, sorry, it's a blue sticker. So with each um, sticker, you look on a wall, it coordinates with a price. So like yellow will be five, purple will be 10, uh, so on and so forth so That's how they had their books done So I picked up Marvel Age number 28 Who doesn't love Toxic Avenger uh, He does have a book Toxic Avenger number 1 But this was before that um, They had him on the cover So scoop that up This book was only $2 So I'll take that every day um, Next book that I did pick up Was Strange Tales number uh, 150 Right here This is a beautiful cover I believe this is the sister of Dormammu. Someone, uh, you know, I'm sure someone will check me on that. Uh, this one has a yellow sticker, so it was like 10 bucks. I picked it up. It's a great looking copy. Uh, so the, this next two slabs actually came in the mail recently. Uh, one was a book that I was looking for for a bit. And uh, Shortbox happened to put it up on their app. If you haven't checked out the Shortbox app, you should. Uh, there's plenty of books there. You're able to uh, actually now submit offers for books. So that's what I did with this one. So this book I picked up was Jungle Action number six, the first appearance of Killmonger. Um, again, this book has been on the radar for a little while. And uh, I, I pushed the button on it. I submitted an offer and they accepted. So uh, very, very glad to own this book beautiful copy uh the next book that i picked up this was actually a, a book jen and i uh decided to with some advice decided to pick up at cloud city uh we made an offer actually right there and they accepted this is batman 386 first appearance of uh the black mask i'm sorry black mask right here again we made an offer on it they were quick to accept the offer, so we ended up getting this book for a really, really good price. And the last book that I did pick up, uh, so I, I, I'm a huge fan of The Goon. I think he's uh, awesome, one of the best, uh, some of the best stories ever. Uh, I really enjoy Eric Powell. I love his work. Uh, so I'm slowly going and collecting uh, those uh, goon books. So one of them uh, was bestsellers number one. Um, so the story behind this, uh, Monster Boy right here, was apparently a prototype of the goon or for the goon, according to Eric Powell. And, uh, you know, he had him in this book right here, bestsellers number one. So I picked this one up. It was actually on eBay. And they actually had it for a really good price. I like way under GPA. 
and uh, I bought it on on the spot, and it, it got here nine four white pages. A really nice book, especially that it's, you know it's, those black covers sometimes uh, could get really beat up, and you could see the color breaks and the tick um, the spine ticks and stuff. So I'm very happy. And that was pretty much my pickups. I did pick up some figures and stuff like that. Um, it's today officially again. All of our local comic shops here in New Jersey are open. Uh, I will. I'll be working this weekend, uh, but next weekend I'm off. So hopefully, hopefully Jen and I can get out to some of our local shops. Uh, we really miss them. We really miss going to these shops and uh, going hunting. Uh, I will say it was a little weird uh, because it was just. We haven't done it since March, pretty much, because everything pretty much shut down. And uh, I know a lot of shops are are cleaning. They're taking social distancing very seriously. Um, you know, as conventions and stuff this year continue to get canceled, um, they just announced Star Wars Celebration was getting canceled. Um, still no word on New York Comic Con, um, Baltimore Comic Con, uh, San Diego Comic Con, and it's canceled as well. So. As that continues to happen, I can see more people going out to the local comic book shops. And we should. We should be supporting our our local comic book shops, helping them uh, recoup some of their losses uh, from the pandemic. You know, it it really hurt a lot of our our shops out there. So let's, you know, let's go out there. Let's dig. Let's let's support our shops. Um, I just want to thank you guys again for checking out this video. I encourage everyone to subscribe to our channel for more content. Uh, We have... You know, a lot of good content coming your way. Uh, I'm going to be doing a room tour. Um, we'll still have hot sauce reviews, comic book reviews. We'll have statue unboxings and more whole videos, mystery boxes, things like that. CGC unboxings. You know, we hope that we have a lot of subscribers. That, um, sorry, we have a lot of viewers that aren't subscribed to the channel. So what I would like to see is for those unsubscribed viewers to please subscribe to the channel. Leave a like, a comment. Let us know what you want to see. Um, let us know what kind of content you're looking for. And uh, I hope that, you know, you guys continue to support. Uh, enrollment starts in July. So be ready to submit those applications. And uh, good luck to everyone enrolling. Uh, you know, don't give up. Get to know people. This is a great community to be in. Um, and uh, with that said, guys, I'll check you out next time. Peace.